Hi, I'm a link from Wind Waker, in which I sail boats. That's why I'm flying. Because I'm in the depths where things are upside down and crazy. Hey everyone, welcome back to Tears of the Kingdom. In the last episode, Alice went, well, through many treks to the depths and uh, through many fights with a bike. Trying to get a couple of treasures done as well as a few enigmas sorted out. And honestly, Kakariko Village Mine did not have anything, did it? Mm -mm. Disappointed. I don't know, but I get the sinking feeling that it's got to have something. Because even the Shrine of Resurrection had a chest. But, you know, either way is fine. This episode, though, I am going to, well, first off, complete the light route that is up in North Hebra. And then I'm thinking we go next to Korok Forest and see if we can get a few more of the depths done mm -hmm. ourselves. I'm so glad we figured out how to make the hover bike because it makes death depth checking easier. It's a way in which we have less death in the depths. The depths. How do you say that even? The depths. The depths. depths. The depths. The depths. The depths. 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 That's like what Johnny I say. Depths. The depth. Depth. Depths. <laughs> I've always called it the depths, but that just that depth. gets rid of the p. I don't know. For me, it's the depths. The depths. The depths. But then so again, more with an well, more with an F then. Yeah, the depth. The depths. Yeah, because I don't know, man. <laughs> Why is English a complicated language? I mean, for God's sake, just think of like through, though, for, uh, and all that jazz. Eh, there, a, there, there. <laughs> yeah, it's a tough language, and honestly, it's got a lot of silly differences. We can't deny that. Mm-hmm. It is a weird language, but at the same time, though, learning a new language is difficult for anyone. <laughs> if God's sake, you tried to learn Japanese. Yeah. Did you feel like you learned anything significant for your time? I learned the basics, but after a while, it's just I wasn't retaining anything. Yeah. Uh. Okay, no, so it's not at the end of the world, but it is one here, so right. Mark that down. Let's get to it. Oh, there's Kogera again. Great! I won't be attacking him. You keep doing you, Kogera. The fact that it has defeated Mark tells me that there's going to be a quest asking us to defeat these things. Yeah. Wouldn't shock me if the monster guy does it again. Yeah. Well, it's good for him because I won't be doing it. I'm not a sucker. Either way. I'm just going down. Get myself a light route and go to Naru Sis. The sister of Naru. <laughs> that looks like a Coliseum, maybe? Or no. another boss platform. Yeah, you know, thing we just passed. Uh -huh. With the mad fluting skills. Now, where did my bike go? Ah, bike's there. Aha. Not that it matters because there's a workshop here, but it's alright. It is perfectly fine. So that's Heber pretty much all done and dusted. Okay, fine, minus this one down here, but oh, it's gonna... It's gonna irk me if I don't do it! No, I have a plan, I'm sticking to it. I'll come back to that at a later time. I have my marker and I want to go down. That means it's gotta go past this race and shine again. Colgate. <laughs> Colgate. Oh, oh gee. no! <laughs> Dead! At least his wings are not a hitbox, I guess. Yeah. I don't think they thought of that. Oh my god. <laughs> We're fine. 
We're fine. What's he going to do? Spikes of death rain down from the sky. He's got nothing. Oh, well, to be fair, I think Colgaro's the best boss fight out of the four. Um, would you class Minaro's boss fight? Or Spirit Temples? Oh, I, I was just saying out of the main four. But... Yep, yep. A Huntsman, agree. Colgaro is definitely the best design boss fight there. Mm -hmm. The second best. I'd say maybe the Gibdo Queen. Yeah, yeah, sure, the Gibdo Queen. And then... The Muck the Rock. Water. What's up? The Muck the Rock. Yeah, but he spits out mud so frequently, it just becomes more busy word than anything. But then again, though, maybe it does emphasize in you learning about the Zonai devices with the hydrogen and whatnot, so I guess that does in of itself work. If I tell Buzz Boss if I can do one. Yeah. Like for me, I wasn't even bothered by the gimmick at the fire temple. Yeah, sure, it was a little bit cumbersome and a little bit confusing from time to time, but no, pretty simple and clean. Like, hey, sort out the mine tracks. Cool. That's fair enough for me. I mean, because I saw a thread asking about the worst boss fights, and most people say it was the Mukto Rock. Not many people said the Goma was that bad. Really? I'm guessing we just didn't know what to do. I have no idea. Okay, now look. It is also because we had difficulty with Yenobo. Yeah. So I feel like, you know what, through those optics, it's more of an indictment about the spirit AI than anything. Because I know it was Yenobo, but he's still operating on the same gimmick. But, oh no. I just... <sighs> what is that interesting structure behind Light Root? This one? Yeah. Enemy base, I imagine. Yep, enemy base. Clip on the statue. Hello. Yeah, that's what I was wondering about. That thing. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even see that. I did not even see that. My God, he's freaking massive. Huh? How did the Bionis get down here? Yeah. <laughs> well, there goes my bike. Jesus Christ, that guy's massive. <laughs> yeah. The Dark Hood. You don't have enough for it. Oh. I can buy this again. <laughs> the joys. My tingles heard again. I would not buy that for love and money. <laughs> Seabree shield, just claim on the going sword. Yes, sir. we still have everything. Mm, but you know what, though? I think I might get the dark trousers. I think we got those already. Nope. In inventory, nada. We could have sworn. Nope. Nope, we do not. Because I know you passed on them. I did? Yes. I thought I bought them. Nope. Nope. You passed on them. Or am I thinking of the trousers of the debts? Most likely this. Yeah. The gators. So, yep, dark trousers, I'm gonna get. I have dark trousers, so therefore, if you have an accent, it will be covered. So mystical up here. Yeah. And it's so nondescript. It's like, 
Why well, have this big thing? I mean, what does he look like? Pretty much the same. It's still so cool to see it though. It is. Oh sure, Link dives off that. I love <laughs> that. I love that. I think that's my favorite depth statue. Without a doubt. It played the tune because you <laughs> dove in the depths, but no trumpets. Wow. Ha ha. Right, well that leaves me a, a bit of an impasse because I'm almost sure that my bike went out of the spawn range. So yeah, looks like I'm walking. That's fine, I got the light. I didn't get, the, are you sure? I got the light route. Just that one over there I need. Sick. Or oh, should I just go up to the tower and actually dive in that? You know what? I might do that because I'm probably going to come down here because right? that's where I, that's where I wanted to go in the first place. So you know what? I'm going to go down two holes today instead of one. Double the fun, am I right? It's so fun diving into chasms. Except when you get them wrong and the game says, no, no fanfare for you. I know. <laughs> You can tell she's upset, audience. I like those trumpets. <laughs> May you never change. <laughs> Hello, Pose. I'm here to land. And also, I'm here to uh, collect the uh, light route that's pretty much right behind me. Oh, no. Where is he seeing me from? What the fr- Oh god! How close to the ground am I? Jesus! Oh, okay, that kind of checks out. Oh, Jesus. Oh god! I've killed one of you already! Cheese it, Sea Link! Dead! You suck! It's funny because you just tried to suck me up. <laughs> you couldn't do it. Link was too slippery for you. Right. Ah. Oh, okay. Sweet. <laughs> I'm about to say. I was about to look up, saying, "Huh? Wonder what a light ruru is." All of a sudden, big orange glow. Nick a kick. He's like kicking nicotine. Wait. Is that one I've already done? I yeah, it probably is, isn't it? That coliseum. No, is that a boss arena? It's a coliseum. That I haven't done. It looks like it. Because otherwise there'd be a name on it, I think. Uh, I think it's probably Lazolfos, because that's the only thing we haven't fought yet. Frick! <laughs> I don't want to do another Sonic stupid Coliseum! It'll just be Lazolfos, probably. Coliseum! Coliseum! <laughs> That's what I've been reduced to at this point. I just see the strong can I just turn into a one word man like Coliseum <laughs> <laughs> So whenever I see a Pokemon announcement that's not Coliseum 2 or remakes like Coliseum <laughs> Or charity events on on Twitch. Coliseum <laughs> Uh All right. Now, this should be the only way I can get a dive. <laughs> Cuz this is the place in which they expect you to jump from. Mhm. Mm no. Do you have to be at the very edge? But the very end is full of gloom. I'm sure Link would still make an attempt to dive through that. 
I don't know, dude. It's so weird the way it works. It Not wouldn't shock me if you have to be, like, right up on the edge. Yeah, well. Let's have a looky loo. Minchie Grove. All right. Uh, well. Guess I can try and make my way in the Korok Forest and do that sodding stupid thing. But at the same time, though, I'll never look around. Might as well see what's available. I mean, that's a grove. It might have a treasure in it. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Let's have a look see. It's either in a big flock of circling trees or in a big stump. Or I could just go to a nearby light route to find out. Works just as well. You collect seeds, I collect souls. We've been over this. I, I can't collect seeds anymore. I know. You have nothing left. That's creepy. Yeah. <laughs> it's the ending of Persona 4, I'm sure. It lights the way, though. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Oh, this seems stumpy. Hell yeah. Give me... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Crystallized charge. Please, no. I will kill this tree. Tunic of the sky. Nice. <laughs> and I believe that completes the sky. Cap the sky. Trouser sky. Tunic of the sky. That's the skyward sword all done. So now we just need... Twilight Princess. Yeah, so what are we missing from that set? Tunic. Oh, wow, yeah, so it's just a trouse and hat. I also, yeah, we also need to get the wild set. No, wait. Time. Yeah, Cap of Time. Cap of the Hero. Yeah, so, so the hero set. The wild set. And I think that's it, yeah. Man, we've nearly got everything. Eo Coke. <laughs> oh, Coke. Oh, Coke. <laughs> oh, I take a drink of that. <laughs> All right, then. So, with that, uh, that one's over there. If I've got, there's one more missing from this, so you know what? I might just go down here, get the light route, and then take out the Coliseum. Oh. Hi. How the is hell? that the light route? What's up? Is that the light route we yeah, need to get? Yeah, it is. How do we ignore that? We're probably still stunned after the Korok Force thing. Oh, most likely. Oh, well, this'll be easy. Yay, we earned it, just like Ash earned Squirtle. Jinjin. Right, Korok Forest is all done. Right, let's go bait people up. Mm. Really? Oh, it's a trail. Oh my god. What in the hell is this? You're gonna fight a Yiga clan at the end of all this, are you sure? You wanna pick them all up? Please tell me it's leading me towards the Coliseum. It's gonna be a Coliseum of Yiga clan members. Oh my god, I think it is. Oh my god, that is fantastic. Holy hell, it actually leads me in. That's actually pretty funny. <laughs> that is hilarious. Lazalpos, you're right. Yeah. So, wh why have the bananas in this one, but none for the others? 
And why is Alfalston not the Eager Clan? <laughs> I have no clue. Oh, oh dear. I wonder what will happen when I collect the last banana bunch. Clearly it will not lock the door and force me to fight Lazolfos. Surely it will not do that. The gasp! <laughs> so does that mean the Colosseums are governed by the Eager Clan? Oh my god. Please tell me that this was meant to be the first one. Please tell me <laughs> this was meant to be the first Colosseum we that they intended for us to do. Lazophos then, not the Bacoblins? I have no clue at this point. These things had some weird design and, and all the quirks. Also, also, can I check out the Yikai member? Look at the guy on the right. Or the left, sorry. Look at his chest. It's extending. <laughs> and yet, his pieces of armor stay naturally in place. <laughs> you noticing that? Yeah. My god. Is this the introduction to the Yiga clan? I have no clue, dude. <laughs> what? He knocks. Um, this was a part of the job description. <laughs> He seems very easy to beat. Wow. And it's a black Hinox as well. They gone. Yeah, they're up there. Damn. I was hoping I could go up and just whack them. Thanks for being an idiot, idiot. But really? You have Lazolfos in waiting in the wings, yet you start off with a Hinox? <laughs> Surely it should be the other way around, right? Or am I crazy? Or maybe this part is just the Yiga Clan exclusive and maybe the Zolfos is a different thing? It's a Korok mask. All right. I mean, fitting Quark Forest. <laughs> yeah, but what? Wait, the wait, the Zophos are gone. I wasn't crazy. There were there were the Zophos in here, right? I heard their squeaks. Yeah. I mean, what if you exited and entered the Colosseum again? In the frick? Okay. Um, okay. I'm officially out. You know what's good? I'll play it safe. I'll fast travel. Reset things. Hopefully. That is so weird. I'm dumbfounded. You didn't even get like a Yiga clan member complaining about that no. either. No, just like, oh, clan, he knocks. Okay, bye. Uh, like, uh, like I said, there are just. S mm. With Breath of the Wild, there was only one way in which you could interact with the Yi clan, at least on a narrative standpoint, and that was at the base with Koga. Mm -hmm. When you spread everything around. It's not on impossible for the developer to say, oh, yeah, sure, we can railroad these players in an open world to go through the narrative in which we want them to. Okay. So no chest. The cages are still closed. And the Zophos are gone. I wonder if what you were hearing was that thing just now. I think, I think the Lizophos was chasing you. Yeah. 
You might have been hearing that Lizalfos just there. I guess it's okay. What would happen then if I just went up here? No, there is no, they aren't there mocking me. No, nothing. But I could have sworn I heard something in the cages. I think it might have been the Lazalfos outside. But I saw something in the cage. He was too small to be a Enox. I. I could have sworn it was like the horn of the Lazalfos. I have no clue, dude. Maybe check back again after a blood moon? Uh, I don't know. Either way, even if I was mistaken and it was meant to be just the Henox, it's still freaking strange. Yeah. Uh, well, either way, guys, that's Korok Forest done, and that is the Skywood Armor ones done and dusted. So, not bad. Not bad at all. We're getting there slowly but surely. It's just doing uh, this portion on the other side of the lake. Or the river and then finishing up Helden. All's one good. No, oh, and there's also a shrine back here. Apparently. <laughs> Don't know. Well, anyway, guys, we're going to end things off there. So next time on Tears of the Kingdom, it's back to Alice, and she'll get to decide where we go from here. But until then, guys, thank you all for watching. If you this episode, then please, yeah, sure, be sure to like it. And of course, if you want to subscribe to see more, then yeah, sure, please subscribe to see more. And we'll see you next time.